The brain, in the case of neglect or deprivation, ex expects input it doesn't receive, so the wiring is altered. This is particularly egregious if the lack of input occurs during these critical periods. So, if you, a child born with cataracts, who doesn't have the cataracts removed until four or five months of age, shows a dramatic recovery in how well they see, but they will always show subtle deficits in processing faces because they didn't see faces in those first few months of life. A child who's born with a hearing impairment who does not have that corrected by, say, a cochlear implant in the first few years of life will always have a residual hearing uh, impairment. So the point then is neglect has a devastating effect on brain development. Just to put this in perspective, if you look at all forms of maltreatment, uh, physical abuse, sexual abuse, emotional abuse, and the like, hands down, neglect is the most common form. In fact, in 80% of the cases reported to child protection, neglect is involved. So there are cases of just neglect, and then even in cases of maltreatment like physical abuse or sexual abuse or emotional abuse, often those children are also neglected. So it is a very big public health problem. For the last 16 years, two colleagues and I have been trying to understand or model how neglect impacts the brain by looking at a very unique set of circumstances, which is uh, children who are abandoned at birth and then raised in institutional settings. So these are some pictures of the children we've been studying all these years in Romania. Some of you uh, may remember many years ago these horrible videos and still images of kids in Romanian orphanages who had been abandoned there by, by their parents shortly after the Ceausescu regime was overthrown in a coup in 1989. And a couple of things to note here is the sheer number of kids all crowded together, how few caregivers there are. If you look at the babies, they're all sitting in cribs staring at a ceiling. And so this is a way to look at the effects of profound deprivation on brain and behavioral development.